My end of year message to the members last year was focused on the horrendous bushfires across the state at the time. The onset of the COVID pandemic that followed those bushfires and floods has been an absolute punish on top of normal operations. I'm sure I speak for many of us when I say that just reaching the end of 2020 feels like an achievement in itself. Through everything that has happened to threaten the safety of our communities, your work as the serving police officers of New South Wales has made a huge difference to those communities. As shown in the police news, the common factor making that huge difference has been your courage. When COVID struck us, your association was there and has remained alongside you, the members, every step of the way. From providing initial industrial advice from day one of hotel quarantine to our input in solving daily issues in the hotels and the border operation. Time and again, the frontline role of keeping communities safe was carried by the police officers of this state. Our message of a thumbs up for safe communities is now even more relevant and seeing the Remembrance Ribbon on the Opera House sales in our centenary year was a special event for us all. Every police officer in New South Wales, from the bush to the city, should be holding their heads high. Depending on each other and having each other's backs is what we do. Our strength depends on our unity and our unity depends on our strength. As we head into 2021, I believe we can learn and take strength from the unity shown in facing each and every challenge that has been thrown at us over the last 12 months. I wish you, your families, your friends and loved ones all the best for a safe and Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Stay safe everyone.